you begin to build an 18,000 square foot home? We have a group of very talented uh, people that we work with, and it's part of the whole team. What's it like working with Tony Viscotti? Working with Tony is a joy. Every day we get to come out to these beautiful projects and oversee the craftsmen that are working on the projects and just making a beautiful finished product. When Tony and I met, he did describe to me the kind of house that he was wanting to build and the price range that he was intending to build in. Uh, at 14,000 plus square feet, we needed a big lot and we needed a location that really made a statement for the kind of product that he was going to build. Bella Custom Homes built a beautiful home and I needed a lot that would be able to showcase that property appropriately and was in a stellar location and Old Preston Hollow was exactly it. Pat I've been wanting to work with so this gave us a good opportunity to come in here and so we started working on something that was symmetrical but really wasn't symmetrical and we wanted to do some really cool things with this house. What were your marching orders? Well, he wanted a, a, large, a large house, and if you're doing a large house, you can't just blow up what you've got. You've got to have correct scale and proportion, because it still has to have human scale and human proportion so people enjoy it and feel comfortable in here. And that was, that was really one of the main things. The other main thing he wanted was a lot of light on the interior, because as you get larger, you have a potential for a dark center. Now this home is a spec home. You don't know who the homeowner is going to be yeah. yet, but you do design build as well. We do, and Tony and I meet with all of our clients throughout the whole process. We're on site almost every day, so uh, we definitely are there throughout the whole process to help our clients. Well, we can start homes that are even 4,000 square feet, 5,000 square feet. We can build from about 1.5 million to 20 million. You know, we have that team that can do that. And it just depends on what goes into the house and what they want. But we've got some beautiful homes that we've finished up just recently that were only 1.6 million. It just depends on what you want to build. You don't always have to have something 18,000 square feet. Um, and the same people that worked on this house worked on the same house that we finished at 1.6 million. Every trade, nobody we interchanged. It was just of the materials that we used that went into the house, mm -hmm. which was appropriate, and the house was stunning when we finished it. You walk into the house and you're going, my God, I can't believe it's 1.6 million. Yeah, it's been four years from the initial design concept to breaking ground and the final construction. Four years, so you know that every single detail was carefully planned, methodically monitored along the way, and just absolutely perfectly executed. I couldn't be happier with the finished product. You know, usually at the end of a project, you walk through and you're like, I might have done this differently or I might have done that differently, but I can honestly say I walk through this house and I just, I love every inch of it. I think it was um, a great team effort. I mean, I am really love how Stacy brought the interior to life and did a lot of the things that we had talked about and we kind of carried through what we initially, what the initial goals were. And it's, it is difficult to get those last details and it's that last 1% that makes the difference, I think. When we start a house, no matter what house it is, we're in the pursuit of excellence on a spec home. We're just in love with the passion of the process of what we're building. When I'm doing a spec house, I'm not really thinking about the buyer, I'm thinking about putting a, a footprint down and everybody will know Bella built it. 